My name is Heather Wilkes and I'm very lucky because I came to the first one, the last weekend and to this one. And I am a raving fan and a lot of people came here because I bludgeoned them into coming. <laughs> and I had the most extraordinary experience uh, for the, from January. I was a volunteer on the Friday night when fortunately there wasn't a camera. And Robert had asked uh, for someone who had a memory they didn't want to talk about. And I'd had this memory pop in my mind while I was sitting listening to him. And it's something I hadn't thought about for about 15 or 20 years, didn't think it was very much. And of course, as soon as I was called out the front, my face just collapsed and off we went. And he never did find out what it was. But it, he cleaned up and checked it and did all this pulling in and out and switching and it was very exciting. And then the next day I attended the seminar. That night, I was driving home from a restaurant and I found I couldn't see through my prescription glasses. And I took them off and I could see better without the glasses. <laughs> now the incident we were working on was when I was about seven or eight years of age. And it was about 12 months after that that the school teacher sent a note home to say Heather's having trouble reading the blackboard. So I had my eyes tested and I've worn prescription glasses ever since to see at the football, cinema, and it's all my life driving. And I had done some work with EFT because I'm an EFT practitioner and it helped a bit, but never to this extent. And I didn't tell anyone on the Sunday because I didn't quite believe it had happened, but I haven't worn glasses to drive since. So it's been very exciting. We didn't tap on anything to do with my eyesight. It was all the emotional stuff of me not wanting to look at something and everything else that went with it, and it's been very exciting. So that's one reason I'm a raving fan, and I'm looking forward to him coming back in November. And thank you so much, Robert.